All right, everybody, welcome back to Mad Max. I just sprayed a uh, crap ton of air freshener in the living room to make it smell delicious in here. So now I'm trying not to cough because I'm an idiot. It's a great smell. I just, uh, just almost killed myself with it. You know, I guess, you know, it wouldn't be too bad of a way to go. Smelling something delicious. Be all right. What are you guys up to? How was your uh, your weekend, your long weekend? If you had a long weekend, I don't know if everybody did, but I'm sure the majority of people had a long weekend. Mine was pretty good, you know. Um, had trouble sleeping, but that's because you know I'm stressed and missing my husband and stuff like that. But other than that, it was pretty good. We had fun. Me and the boys had fun. We spent time together watching movies, eating chili dogs, you know, doing. Doing what is it? What is it? Green? What is that? Tell me. Is it, where the where the heck is that? That's uh, ooh, what's ooh. I don't know what this is, but I'm gonna go touch it. As soon as I figure out what the green is, is that inside? Maybe. There's a lot of stuff I need to clear out. <laughs> this place still. Maybe we should do a little maintenance while I'm here. Let's go clear out this sniper point here. Then I'll get my dog here. Did I already get this one? Oh, I haven't got- okay, let's go get this first. I feel like those are important, you know, so you can see where everything is so you don't get totally boned by every single sniper in the area. But you know I will. <laughs> I'm really good at that. Jesus. No, I don't want to race. Okay, they put a bomb on the other side of my car. I already did it once. That's enough of a rush. Sometimes I feel like Chum's addicted to the adrenaline. I mean, that's fine. He can be addicted if he wants. He just needs to stop trying to bring me down with him. Woo! That was on purpose, by the way. <laughs> I'm dicking around in my car. Which I probably shouldn't do, because I'm good at crashing. Actually, I think I've improved quite a bit from when I first started playing this game, where I couldn't take a corner to save my life, and now I can kind of take a corner to save my life. Whoop! Not that one, though. <laughs> there we go. I thought I was going to run into the wall. See what happens when you open your mouth. Bad stuff happens, that's what. Oh, why is it so smoky in here? We get it. I thought there was a guy up there and he just didn't see me. I have to climb. Ugh, fine. <laughs> the guardian stands ready to honk and holler. Good. I need an explosion. Do you have one of those? Do we have an explosion? Why do we need an explosion? Why can't we just, you know... Ugh, I don't have... Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We are going to be this thing's worst nightmare. Blow it up. Thank you, chum. I appreciate it. Yeah, that's right. Disappear, door. Okay. Oh. Go on. Go. Alright, whose face do I have to punch to get a balloon around here? This place is great! Look, they got- they got <laughs> maggots and scrap. <laughs> I'm not really hungry, but thank you for the offer. I appreciate it, um, you know, but I'm good. I've got water, so. No one up here? Weird. I mean, there's not always. Sometimes, you know, I'll find something that uh, tries to beat my ass. So are you empty or what? No, oh, get in, Max. He's clearly drunk. Oh, it's full up. Nice! Someone's been out here. Is 
Let's go see what madness awaits us. I love this game. It's so pretty. I mean, I know, like, it's not, you know... What can I compare this to, animation-wise? Looks peaceful from afar. Does it? Not so worthy. No, it's got giant holes in it and stuff. <laughs> Duh. Of course it's not seaworthy. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a sniper. Whatever. He ain't got nothing on me. Dude thinks he's all that in a bag of potato chips. I'm gonna ruin his day. You're probably thinking, Carrie, what is the drunk way that you're scanning things? What? That's simple. I'm doing it in a way that lets me um, look all... Is that? Oh, it's just a uh, smoke coming from it. Maybe there's some dude bros down there hanging out. Whoop. Oh, death run. No, thank you. That's something that Chum would want to do, and if he wants to, he can go right ahead, but he's not using my car. He can use that little buggy of his to do that shit. <laughs> It's not that I hate the death runs, it's just they're timed, and I don't like being timed unless it's absolutely necessary. Like, I'm playing Resident Evil right now, I'm gonna have to fight that dude, which I don't think I'm very prepared for, so you know how that is. So yeah. I didn't get nearly as many things as I thought I would. I'm super surprised. Usually it's like giving my map the chicken pox when I find stuff, but it was only like a couple of things I missed, I guess. That's fine. I wonder what happens if you run out of gas with this thing. You know, like you're going up? And then all of a sudden you're just out of gas? Like, what What would you do in that situation? Would you just live up there? Like, would it fall out of the sky? I'm real glad I printed this out before the grid went down. I can still smell that great grub. I wonder if the days of beer and barbecue will ever return. The smell of barbecuing meat is everywhere. But not the kind you'd want to eat. Well, that depends, Max. If you're a cannibal or not. <laughs> no one wants to eat that. It's like, except for those guys that do. I'm sure we've run into a few of them already. Don't judge. <laughs> I'd judge the shit out of them. Be like, dude, you can't just go around eating people. It's rude. It's like, they're like, what, you're worried about him being rude? It's like, yeah, it's not nice. <laughs> care about the whole ooh. <laughs> You'd probably look at me weird after that. Like she just said it was be <laughs> Alright, this is a difficulty of three it says, but that's what they all say. I don't care about you. Oh look at that. Eliminate threat oh, um th sure, but I'm gonna go do this stuff first. Let's go get the crap out of us. Sorry. Jeez. My throat is just like, let's clog up for no reason. There's nothing. It's like, that's the kind of stuff you do when something's emotional throat, not just because you feel like it. cars out of holes for you. you do oh, there's a guy over there. Though. He's probably really surprised. Is like, that Mad Max's car? I guess it was. Thanks for noticing. Yeah, I had those off-road tires now, which is nice. Where? Where is he? Hold on. Where is that little fucker? Yeah, I know. I know. I just drove it up the side of that. Where is he? Ow! What the heck? Oh, there he is. Trade me, bro. Gonna ruin this fool's day. Go ahead. Open fire, bitch. 
Ow! God damn it. Oh, there's two. Oh, that's where I was going. Well, that makes sense. I like to think that they're very surprised when that shit happens. In fact, I hope they are. You ever, I mean, <laughs> you imagine not being surprised? It was weird feeling that someone's gonna come up behind me and try to kick my ass. Anything over there? No, it looks like the top of a ship. I don't see any more of these sons of bitches. The, uh, you know, explody doodles. I know that's not the proper name for them, but that is what I'm going to call them. The explody doodles. Nice try. Rough. What, them exploding? Looks like it's more than a little rough. Ugh, I can't see around this corner and I'm not a big fan. What is grinding, chum? What are we driving on? Metal? My tire explode? I know I'm taking this slow, but I'm more worried about there being another little thing to do. I don't have proper words for anything that I say. In fact, I always tell Josh I'm going to have the hardest time becoming a medical assistant because I just call, like, everything the knobbly bit, you know? It's like, what hurts? It's like my knobbly bit. It's like, it's like, those are the bones on your wrists and ankles, like your radius and your ulna are the knobbly bits, and then the whatever's on your ankles. <laughs> knobbly bits, okay. Anything that's bony and protrudes out is a knobbly bit, so, you know. Sometimes I'll just be like, yeah, it's the knobbly bit that hurts. It's like, that doesn't make any sense. It's like, it does to me. What is that? What are you? Oh, you're a car. <laughs> Someone set you on fire for no reason. That looks slightly reinforced. Alright, trade back. Oh yeah, we can pull that shit down. We've come through. Yes, we have. Can I drive in here? Fuck yeah. I'm gonna be really surprised when they see a car coming down here to kill them. Oh, I can't go any further than that. Lame. Wait here. Certainly. Oh, yes. when did I get shot? Oh, I got shot by the sniper, that's right. Well, I got water, so it's all good. This is what getting waterlogged is for. There we go. Alright, we're gonna... Kinda wanna take this and put it in the back of my car for safekeeping. You know, just in case. Uh, there we go. Boom. I mean, I never have to worry about refueling because I could just go to Jeet's place or whatever and it's like, here's some free gasoline. And I'm like, woo! Anything special in here? What if I blew this up? Do you think they'd notice? You know, let's find out, shall we? Oh. Nope. <laughs> They did not. I'm just gonna hang out here on this ladder. I wonder if they can hit me if I do that. Alright, what do we got going on in here, guys? Hmm? Anybody wanna mess with me? I'm ready for a fist fight. Whoa, okay. What? You guys need to calm down. Oh, there he is. Excuse me. Ow, no. Whoa, okay, I was not trying to do that. <laughs> How does it feel that I just kicked the shit out of everybody on accident? 
I did not mean to do what I did, by the way. Oh, I hate these guys. They make me mad. Stupid knife. The, the guys who are always painted yellow are the ones that use the knives, typically. And they just like to dodge around like they're a bunch of- No! No! Collect! <laughs> He's not having any of it today. Okay. I don't know what that ability is. I must have gotten something special at one point and forgot about it. Any scrap hidden down here? Oh, there's a little hidey hole right here. I'm gonna check all the sp all the spaces. What is this? Where does this go? Is this going where I need to be? Or is this going where I think I need to be? I'm gonna go open that door first. There's so many options. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, there's more food. There's more maggots. Fantastic. Still not hungry. But once again, thanks for the offer. I just drank all my water, so I am full up on everything. Oh wait, are there any... Uh, no. Okay, I was looking for those stupid scrotus emblems hanging around that, that glow. Like someone put radioactive paint on them, which they probably did because they're stupid. It's like, what's that paint? It's like, I don't know, man. It glows in the dark, so... <laughs> Can you imagine glowing the dark? Oh, there's one. Can you imagine glowing in the dark paint in this world? It'd be a freaking trip, wouldn't it? They'd be like, oh my god, it glows. Like, if they didn't grow up with glowing the dark paint, you know what I mean? Do I need to kick this down or can I just use it? Okay, no, it's just there. There are way too many options. They've given me too many places that I can go. What is this? Oh, it's a spear? Oh, I like having a spear. I'm gonna go all endeavor on these fools. If you haven't watched My Hero Academia, you're like, who the fuck is Endeavor? <laughs> so, there's this kid named Todoroki. Actually, his first name is Shoto. The, you know, in Japan, it's last name first. Anyway, there's this kid named Todoroki, and his dad is also named Todoroki. But his hero name is Endeavor. And he's a dick. Like, a big one. For now. Um... But one of his superpowers, like, he uses fire, but he can, like, form it into different shit, and he can make it into a spear, and it's really cool. Oh no, it's a bunch of people. Whoa. Whoa, they all came at me at once. Whoa. Oh, Max. <laughs> That's what I love about these dudes, is their ability to just take out their entire team on their own. I don't even have to do anything. I can just like dodge and stuff, and they're just like, ah, oh, come here, bitch. Oh, that guy's gonna get me. Oh, those guys are the worst. There we go. So I need to give myself some distance. Oh, thank you. Hard on a man. Here he comes. Like a goddamn bull. Did you just back off for like two seconds? Hey, buddy. Sorry, did I ruin your day? I hope so. It's one of my favorite things to do in this game. Shatter shields. <laughs> just because it makes me look like even more of a badass than I already am. Oh, bring it on, baby. I don't give a shit. Who's next? I'm ready. Let's go. Jump on down here, fool. Let's go. He's stuck. <laughs> He's like, I would, but I'm stuck on this wall. <laughs> so I guess you'll just have to stay up there then. Or I'll go find, like, a spear to kick your ass with. I don't know why I wasted that bullet. Whatever. I got the bloodlust, so I'm just gonna go with it. Oh, he made it down here finally! Good for you! See, it just takes a little bit of effort. 
you put in the work, you get results. That's exactly what he did. <laughs> Anyway, back to talking about anime, because, uh, it's one of my life's greatest loves. Oh yeah, I gotta hold it. I forgot. Um, go watch My Hero Academia. I watch the dub, I just prefer it, you know? I mean, I do watch some anime subbed, and I know some people are like, Ugh, Carrie, how can you just watch dub stuff? I like the voice actors, that's how I can do that, so, you know. I recommend watching it, like, all, because it's very, very good. Um, oh, okay, well, thanks for the shortcut, I appreciate it, I guess. Endeavor's the kind of character- uh-oh. Uh-oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I was stuck. <laughs> Endeavor's the character that you- you really, really just absolutely abhor at first. Like, he's the worst. I mean, he's not the worst of the worst, but he's pretty... He's up there. He's like, I don't know, maybe the second worst. Um, he's a he- and he's a hero, and he's kinda got the whole, like, mentality, like, I gotta be better than everyone else because reasons. Um, but after a while, he kinda starts to grow on you because he starts to realize some things, and... Yeah, so it's pretty interesting. He's got very interesting character development. Should I... You know what I'm gonna do? Is that another one of those? Is that another pump jack up there? I don't think so. I'm gonna go clear out everything before I do this, just because I want to. Um, he's one of those characters that grows on you. And you don't expect him to grow on you, but he, he does. It's weird. Because, yeah, he's a, he's a piece of crap. If you watch the show, you'll understand what- oh, 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 okay, that's not very nice. You'll understand what I mean. Um, and he's got some pretty, like, kick-ass epic powers. It's like, you know, Todoroki says, like, his dad's a, a piece of shit, but he's like a badass piece of shit. <laughs> so, you're just like, God, I hate this guy, but holy shit, he's so cool. Well, does this lead me back to the entrance? What other pieces of scrap did I miss then? I must just be blind. Maybe it's all down here with these things I get to explode for no reason. I don't know. Could be. Let's just drop down right here and break my shins. I don't need them. Fuck my legs. I don't know why I slide down any ladders. I should just always just jump off stuff just for fun. Just to see what happens. See how bad the game will punish me for being dumb. I like to test the game's patience. Wow, that's a lot of gasoline. I already stole one of the... the doodads, so... I should just go stand in the oil and throw this at that, right? Why not? I love how he thinks he gets far enough back, but I'm not sure if he knows what far enough back is. Because <laughs> he was, like, in that explosion's face. Okay, so there's a historic relic still here. I saw the other insignia and a little bit more scrap. I'm gonna try to find it. I really like the historic relics. I think they're- uh, There we go. <laughs> I think they're pretty cool, like, having all this neat shit to read. How do I get up here? There's no, like, yellow, so I can just go jumping up and down. Usually they're like, here you go. Do I need to use my gun? Because I can't. Ooh, what if I stood on top of this? Ugh, you're the- oh, you're the worst at jumping, Max. Just thought I should tell you, and then- oh, I can't see it from this side. What if I get on these? I'm sure this is not the way you're supposed to do this, but- did I get it? I did! <laughs> I'm sure the game's like, oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> like, you need to go around, stupid. It's like, well, you didn't give me any other options, so there. I did it my way. You can't tell me how to play this game game, alright? I, I break all the rules. 
like to imagine just the developers just like shaking their head like oh my god did she really just do that <laughs> it's like yes i did and i would like to know where the rest of this scrap is and also the historic relic why do i feel like it's over there <laughs> like where that is got this weird feeling that it's it's right over there where I just was. Or I missed it entirely because I'm blind. I'm not blind. I don't have bad eyesight. I just play like I have bad eyesight. Alright, let's 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 look at our surroundings here. It's gotta be a way... There's a scrap right there. I can see it. Wait, there's stairs. I need to get in there. How do I get in there? Is there a ladder? Is that what that ladder is? There wait, wait. Yeah, there's that one. I need you. I need you, Mr. Ladder. Oh, that's what it was for. I thought it was back up and around. I'm just dumb. See? I'm not blind. I just act like it sometimes. There we go. I'm talking about. I want the door to come back and hit you in the face, Max. I know it's tempting, but don't. There's no more bad guys in here, so I can just kind of walk around like I own the place, which I kind of do. Or are they going to tell me any different? Are they going to act like Max Rokakansky can't just take what he wants? Uh... Public notice, sudden onset of fever and explosive vomiting of clear liquids in infants is an indicator that the child may be infected. Bring child and anyone who has had contact with child to quarantine immediately. Like a body, every organ just shut down. Until the world was dead. That would... suck. That would more than suck. That's like, utter devastation. It's like, hey, your baby's sick, and I'm like, from what? It's like, we don't know the water? <laughs> it's like, are you kidding me? Yeah, it would kill me. I'd be absolutely devastated. Oh my god, is this how I was supposed to get to that insignia? <laughs> and I just was like, nope. <laughs> I did my own thing, it was. <laughs> yeah, I'm too cool for fucking the right way. Okay, well, now I know. <laughs> like I said, they're probably just <laughs> they would be shaking their heads so hard at me like, are you kidding me? There was a thing right there and it's like, oh well it took too long to find it, so I just did my own thing it says I'm still missing some scrap, but I don't know where it is sorry about that I've been really tired like I said, I've, I've been having trouble sleeping just not like a lot of trouble it's just like every now and then my I'll be like I can't sleep and you know I just so I'll just like go to bed late I'm like well this is my life now series of late nights wasn't there another ladder where, where is oh it's the one that leads up to the zip line that's fine let's see if there's anything else interesting up here probably not which is also fine I'm always missing stuff, so you never know. Yeah, nothing else interesting up here. Would you stop with the creepy violin music? This is a horror game? I'm just trying to find scrap. Jeez. Whatever, I'll go back down. Whee! I always get halfway tempted to just, like, let go early. <laughs> when he's ziplining down to see if I can like severely injure him and then I decide not to because I feel bad <laughs> I'm like I can't just hurt Max for no reason I mean I could but that'd be mean you get really attached to fictional characters Max is no different yeah I don't know where the rest of that scrap is but at least I got the relic that I wanted so I just kind of missed some scrap, which happens quite often. That's okay. At least they'll be happy to know that they can have this place now. Like, this is your home, guys. Have fun. So I don't want it. I'm more of a driving around, sleeping in my car kind of guy, I think, than an actual, like, hanging out with people and making friends kind of guy. So feel free. 
Are you wearing goggles? Oh, good. <laughs> I'm just gonna stare right into it. What your spy spy? I spied something dead because I killed it. Whoa, I forgot that we came in past these weird ass barriers. Like, totally forgot. How come we don't set up snipers? Wouldn't that be smart? I mean, there's always a shit ton of towers left. That's what I would do, right? What you would do? I would set up snipers everywhere, just for fun. Like, not even- she sets, leaving us in utter darkness. Dude, it's just nighttime. Don't be so dramatic all the time. It's disturbing. Wait, there's a sniper over here. I want to go shoot in the face. Just out of principle. Oh, hey, water people. Hi, water people. How are you doing? We're going to get ran down as soon as I get out of this car to help you, though. Because that's how the world works. I need a Don't lot strike. of things. No, 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 Max, you dingus. Sorry, two seconds. <laughs> I'm not quite all there. It's all this, you know, heat. Do you want some water? Yeah. Here you go. Some water. Go ahead, drink it before some cars come around the corner for no reason and run us all over. <laughs> Thank you, stranger. My name's Max. You should know that by now. No, no, no. Oh, I hate when it does that. When it <laughs> when it floats me up into the air like that, it's killed me once. All you fools need to move and also watch out for that tornado. I love how they're, st they're standing like two inches from my car. It's like, you know this thing's a beast, right? I will run you down on accident. Oh, here it comes! The mighty duster! Yeah, but can it keep up? So don't worry about it. Chum is probably the most nervous, like, sidekick I've ever had in the game. I mean, I get it. He's, like, living in this, you know, world. You know, hunchbacking around. Um, so, you know, maybe that's just because that's what makes him so much more jumpy than normal people. But it's like, you know, I have characters like Cole and Solus and stuff who have probably been through... Equally fucking shit. Oh, nice try. Nice try, jerk. Yeah, who's dead? You are. I don't know, it's just weird. Like, he's like, he's the jumpiest. Well, there's nothing interesting up here. Just this dead sniper. I wonder what happened. Aw, I was hoping I could just bump it. It's like, weak tower, and I'm like, alright. There we go. <laughs> that made me feel better. Oh, hey, he's got a bullet I can have. Sorry, sorry about the. Mm -hmm. Oh, is it because I bumped into that tower just a little bit? I don't know who's calling me, so they're just gonna have to. <laughs> he's trying to. Those guys. <laughs> they're, they're like, where is he? <laughs> they could feel me, and they but they couldn't find me. Oh, there's, it says there's a thing over here. Oh, it's on the other road. Okay, someone just tried to call me. I have no idea who it was, but I didn't answer. <laughs> I know it may be weird, but I um don't really answer people unless I know their phone number. <laughs> One, because I know it's probably not an emergency. And if it is, they'll call back. So. Most of the people that I know are in my phone. And usually when it's like an unknown number or one that I've never seen before, it's always a telemarketer. And they're always trying to sell me like some weird cruise thing. And I'm like, no thanks, I don't like boats. Because I've never been on one. <laughs> I'm gonna go on a cruise ship? It's like, dude, I've never even been on a little paddle boat, so no. I've been on a jet ski, I don't know if that counts. 
That looks dangerous. What is that? What is that red? Do you see that? I want to get out. What is that? What is that? I'm scared to get close to it, if I'm being honest. Okay, well, I guess it was nothing. How weird. Huh. Well, I have the perfect thing to explode this door in my car. I wonder if something else exploded here. <laughs> hey, Jem, I need that, that can that I put in here. Thank you, buddy. See, I told you we were gonna need it. <laughs> and you doubted me, Chum. Actually, he, I don't think he ever doubts me. He's never questioned me before. It's kind of weird. Like, he's never I mean, he does say things like, we should be doing something. And I'm like, oh. Okay. There we go. That is one way to get into this place. What's in here, then? Looks like someone's been hiding supplies. Thank you. We done took this whole place. Nothing left to grab. City empty after the big drive. Berserkers rallied to the boneyard. Next stop, shopping mall south. Ooh, there's a shopping mall to the south? Well, we should go there. I bet that's exciting. I wonder if it's still standing. Let's go find out. Where am I pointed right now? So I am not- I'm pointed to the east. So if it's south, I need to go in the other direction. But I kind of want to go down this tunnel to see what the hell's down here. It's just really interesting. Ah! Uh, I can't drive. Oh, don't scream. I barely tapped the hole. I was going like a hundred- oh, it's just like a roundabout. Oh, interesting. Okay, he wanted to go south, which is in this general direction, I guess. I'll turn to the south. I wanted to go to the giant mall they keep talking about. It seems so interesting. It's so much more interesting than what I'm doing right now. Is that a sniper in there? Oh no, it was just down there. I want to go down here. What else is there for me to destroy? Because, it, oh, it's that minefield. Okay, well I need to get my dog. Um. I don't think Gutgash has a bed for him yet, so we'll just fast travel on over here. To Jeet's place. Cause he's like our like number one favorite character. Well, you know, Jeet is cool, Chum, the dog, my shaman. <laughs> Hi Jeet. I didn't come here to visit, I just came here to get my dog wherever he is. You didn't eat him, did you? Hi puppy. How are you? Clear out some No, no, that's not what I wanted to do. God damn it. You have to do it the other way. You have to, um, move back in, hit square, and then pick a different car, and I always forget that. Why can't I just take the dog out in this? I'm just saying. Where's your do- oh, stop. Your dune buggy. I want that one. Yes. I got explosives to clear out with my dog. Alright, puppy. Let's go do some stuff. You ready? We're heading out, dog. His name is Dee Dee. Okay, say it right. <laughs> or just call him Dinky. I would totally name my dog Dinky. It's so cute. I'm just gonna start naming all of my dogs after, like, dogs from... Oh, shit. Oh, he doesn't... He's not gonna do anything. Maybe. I don't think so. I think he's gonna try to run from me. They always do, with these guys. They get really nervous, like, when you're around. Because they're weird and slightly insane. Yeah, I think he, like, turned around to get away from me, and then he's like, uh-oh. <laughs> He went in the exact same direction that I was going. What am I gonna do now? I don't know, drive past me? I'm not gonna catch you. I don't have my regular car. I'm 
come back for you later, dude. Right now I gotta go clear out some explosives with my dog. And by dog, I mean an actual dog, not chum. Not D-A-W-G dog. Oh, you go to track board. Who are you barking at? Oh. I'm starting to go ape shit here in a second. Nothing? We're not close? You better not be lying to me or we'll both explode. This is very unnerving. See it, Dinky. Where are you pointing? Ah, there it is. Okay, I just wasn't close enough to see it. I'm always afraid to go walking through here when he's found one because I'm afraid I'm gonna find another one on my own. Bring your ass over here. You better just stay right where you are, dude. Mind your own business. Chum would be ticked off if I rammed into their car with his dune buggy. I'm probably right. do is make friends in the apocalypse and it always results in me having to do some crazy ass shit <laughs> like go clear out this minefield with your dog it's like okay I need you to get a sail for me it's like like a like a sail like on a boat it's like yes <laughs> We found that one immediately. That was close to me. Yeah, I know, honey. I can see. I can see it. I can see it. I can see it. Calm down. I think I got all three. There we go. You're welcome, world. We're good at this. Good dog. You want to go ruin that guy's day? I kind of want to go ruin that guy's day. They kill both of them or just one? Oh. 
Oh yeah, I got both. Good for me. Alright, we need to go back and get the regular car or we're gonna get our ass kicked. Still says there's stuff here that I can do. I don't know. Maybe I need to clear out this thing here. Which I don't want to do, but I will. I have a I have a bias towards Jeet as a favorite character because, like I've said before, the guy who plays his voice is the same guy who plays the voice of Shiro in um, Voltron, like the new one, and he's my absolute favorite favorite character. I adore the shit out of him. And any time something bad happens to him, I just want to you know strangle the person who has dared to lay a hand on him. I mean, he's everyone's favorite baby, so you better just back off, okay? He's a great character, because um, he was like tortured and stuff, and he suffers from PTSD. But he's like this- he's this character who won't tell anybody that he's having problems. He's very stoic about it most of the time when he's in front of everybody else. Um, but he's like- he's just a great character. He's super supportive of all of his friends and everything. I will have to say though, I was a little disappointed in his ending. But it was mainly because of the way it went about. We didn't really get to know a certain character well enough, and he kind of didn't wind up with who I thought he was going to wind up with. You know, because we were kind of setting it up, it seemed, for something else. But it's fine, you know. It's, it's one of those things where I'm like, I'm kind of disappointed, but also Shiro's happy, so I'm happy. So yeah, it's just like a weird... Uh, Buzzards. Buzzards, whatever. We're gonna go up here and get this relic, and then that's gonna be it for today, because my phone just went off to tell me that I'm done. It, it nags me. You know, it's like, okay, that's enough. You've had enough fun for the day. I've also got homework to do, so it's for the best. This doesn't look like a trap or anything, right? Look at this. What is this? What is this madness? I'm slightly disturbed by what is going on here. Oh, it's a crevice. Of course it's a crevice. Why don't you just climb on in this hole, Keep Max? Safe. I yes. will do Help that. Ew. Don't be long, please. Don't be long, or what? What are you gonna do? Cry about it? Sorry that you're such a nervous wreck all the time. I wanna go get in a fist fight with some weird people. Hear that? What's up? A gas towner! No, no, I'm not a gas towner. I'm a... You know. What's the other word for people who- Hi! That's rude! How do I- do I just jump down to you? Come closer! You come closer. You first. <gasps> Ow! He just hit me with a rock! Oh, fuck you guys. Where you at? Oh. Get friends? I was trying to be polite. Okay, I just want the thing that's in here. You guys are just gonna go around throwing stuff at me. Rude. Yeah, I know my chain is on, but there's no one else around, so just calm your tits. Fight. Fight. Rock. Will you die? Because that's not exactly like what's happening right now is your death. You guys are all a bunch of rude asses. Let's just try to beat up the guy who just killed everyone. That's a good idea. Maybe we just scrap that. What? Am about full. I call shenanigans. I guess that was all it was. All right then. Well, that was fun. Now I gotta make my way back to the car. Uh, but that is gonna be it for today, guys. It's freaking awesome. Uh, thank you for coming in and watching this episode of Mad Max. I hope you had just as much fun as I did beating the shit out of people uh, who looked at me the wrong way um, and also threw rocks at me. So those guys deserved it. I don't know about the first ones, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, I love you guys. I love this game, and I will see you next time, okay? All right. Bye!